BricsCAD lets you customize the functions of mouse buttons. To be able to customize them, you need to be able to identify them, and so this is how BricsCAD identifies mouse buttons. The right button is button number one, the middle one is number two, and the left one is number three. If you have a mouse with a roller wheel on it, then the roller wheel is button number two, and to activate it, you press down on it, just as if it were another button. But you cannot customize button number three, because that's the one we always, always, always use to pick things, and so it cannot be customized. But the keyboard lets you increase the number of parent customizations of buttons. When you hold down the shift key, you can click the right, the middle buttons. Similarly, you can hold down the control key to do the same thing, and finally hold down the shift and control keys and press each of those buttons. access the customization of mouse buttons, right-click any user interface element, such as the ribbon here. I'll right-click it, and then choose Customize. Here's the Customize dialog box. Now look across these tabs here, and eventually you find Mouse. Click Mouse, and here's the buttons that you can customize, sorted by whether it's a single click or holding down a keyboard button with one of the clicks. Let's examine the first one by clicking on this plus sign to open it up. So the first one we see is the right button. And so that's something we can customize. Then there's this middle button. It already has something attached to it, which is the snap menu. So when you right click, the snap menu appears. Now I want to uh, customize something in conjunction with the shift key, because I don't want to interfere in any regular click operations. So there's your right button, and your middle button. I want to assign an object snap. Now when we look over in this other pane, we can see various commands that are available that we can assign to it. And pretty much any command in all of BricsCAD is available. Notice as I scroll through here, all the different topics. Now what I want to attach is an entity snap. And I want, to, every time I hold down the shift key and press the right button, I want snap to endpoint either be turned on or turned off. So I'm simply going to drag it over into the right button. And you can see right button snap to endpoint. Let's try it out. Click OK to close the customize dialog box. Use the line command to draw a line. And now when we look up here in entity snaps, they're all turned off. Hold down the shift key, press the right mouse button. Notice that it's turned on. And now I can draw and it'll snap to the endpoint. End the command, and when I hold down the shift key and right click, it's turned off again.